So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are in the conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. If you're just joining us, we are already on the way. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Uh, a fairly easy choice for me, this one, Aaron Ramsey. Uh, what has helped him to elevate his game is the timing of his forward running. He's transformed his contribution from good to great since he increased his appetite for goals. And boy, can he score a beauty. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Ramsey spreads it towards the left. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. And it's played forward. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Allen. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Ramsey. He's got it, and chance! intercepted really alert to the danger gets into a dangerous position Tosun balls loose who's getting there he'll try from distance goal Turkey oh, whose goal is that big deflection that's one for the dubious goals panel Turkey break the deadlock still a fragile lead though they can't afford to sit on this Tufan battles to win it back now it's Burak Yilmaz Davis positions himself well and cuts it out it's cut loose Offside, yes, it is. Keeper sends it forward. Now it's Bale. What an adventurous run from a defender. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Forward it goes. Tufan. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Good challenge, he just stood firm. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. That's been one straight back. Tosun. Goes 
for goal! A real chance and a real let-off. Well, Peter, I would say it was worth a try. Very well to intervene. Ramsey. Lovely bit of skill there. Allen. Brings it forward. This is quite a run and he's not done yet. Burek Yilmaz. That's good defending, very good defending. Hoists it forward. Shelhanolu. Driving on a real charge here. Receives it from behind. That's a throw. And out it comes again. Has a pop! It's got a rattled. Wales keep the ball, but can't do anything meaningful with it. Looks to bypass the midfield. Tries to get it forward quickly. Now it's Chelhanolu. And half time whistle goes. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The midfield did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Turkey leading 1-0 at the break. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Turkey going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. Oh, real danger here! Allen. Ramsey. Out to the right. Oh, no question, that's a foul. to safety promising move that good inroads into enemy territory but no joy he spotted the run and played him through going through forward pass Allen goes looking. Mepham plays it forward. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. And it's Yilmaz. Yilmaz with a really impressive run, which nearly went the whole way. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. So Inju drives it forward. Yilmaz gets flagged offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. So Inju drives it towards the front. Davis gets it forward. Chalanolu tries to get it forward quickly. Tosun. And here's Burak Yilmaz. Burak Yilmaz really got caught in a trap there. And he just couldn't get out. 
Ramsey. Played in with accuracy. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. And it's Bale. It's a loose ball. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Hennessy gets it upfield. And here's Burak Yilmaz. It's come through. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. Neither side really getting hold of the ball. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Oh, he's not going to get that. Turkey are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. Has he found his man? Just brushed off the ball there. Tufan passes it forward. Forward it goes. That's alert and sharp and very well played. They seem to have lost their sense of direction. Uh, it should be higher up the pitch. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now. Got a shot away! And the keeper's relieved to see that disappear wide. Burak Yilmaz probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. another change here yeah it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off his energy levels began to to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle they are right into last chance territory Wales have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on Ampadu hoists it forward it out to the wing oh that is lovely footwork and it's played forward <laughs> referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle what a game end to end it flew by and in the end it all came down to just the odd goal your reflections then Jim well to me this is a result Peter that says an awful lot more than the scoreline suggests you know after the goal the team just settled down and and looked surprisingly comfortable and didn't really need to work too hard. So before we go, many thanks to Jim Beglin for his input and from us both, good afternoon.